Hi guys, it's Bentley and we are here in North Carolina showing you guys a barbecue joint that's having customers line up since the day they opened. That's right guys, we're here at JD's Smokehouse. If you guys are excited for this video, give it a thumbs up and click that subscribe button. We're excited, so let's get to eating. All right, you guys, before I dive into these ribs, comment down below where you had your best barbecue experience at. Leave it down in the comments down below, okay? We don't have a knife for this, but I don't think you're going to need it for these ribs right here. Oh, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go ahead and take a bite. <laughs> Oh yeah, mmm. That dry rub has a hint of sweetness, very savory. A lot of smoke comes through, and I love how they leave the membrane on the ribs. Uh, also, comment down below if you're a me like membrane on the ribs kind of a person, or if you like it off the ribs. Mm. Look at this. I'm just gonna pull apart this rib. <laughs> and I'm gonna dip it in their sauces. So here we have the uh, tomato based barbecue sauce. We have Carolina vinegar based sauce. We have a hot mustard. And then we also have a hot barbecue sauce right here. So I'm gonna dip it in their classic tomato based barbecue sauce. Ooh, just look at that. Look how it glistens. Barbecue sauce is sweet and a little tangy. Mm. Oh yeah, these are, <clears throat> if you love a sweet based barbecue sauce, this one, definitely go with this one. Some barbecue joints, they don't have a lot of meat on their ribs, but these ribs definitely have a ton of meat attached to these ribs. Mm. All right, so I'm gonna dip it in this uh, vinegar based sauce right here. North Carolina is known for their vinegar based sauces. So, oh yeah. Mm. I'm going for that. Mm. That vinegar sauce, it cuts right through the richness of the ribs. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna dive right into the, uh, the mustard sauce right here. Oh yeah. Mmm. Oh yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Very tart and acidic. And it's a great sauce to cut, like I said, to cut through that richness of the ribs. And last but not least, we're gonna go with their hot based barbecue sauce right here. This one's gonna be the spicy one. Mm. And I love spice, so I'm gonna go a little extra on that dip. <laughs> oh yeah. Mm. Mm. This is probably my favorite of all the sauces. It has, it has a little bit of sweetness, savoriness, there's, there's a little bit of heat behind the throat, but it's so nice and the spice just like excites your senses. <laughs> All right, guys, so I'm gonna go in for the brisket. Mm, just look at that. Look at the smoke ring and look at the char on that. Oh yeah, and a little bit of fattiness. Ooh, pull that apart. Oh yeah. Mmm. <laughs> All right, yeah, I got a good, I got, I, I'm gonna get a good bite here. I got like a little bit of the fat and the meat. Mm. I'm gonna dip it, I'm gonna dip it in this spicy barbecue sauce right here. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Mm. The brisket's so smoky and savory, salty, mm. and then you get a little bit of sweetness from the barbecue sauce and spiciness. Mm -hmm. That's just like the most perfect bite. <laughs> so good. Just look at the smoke bark on that. Ooh. Oh, dip it in this spicy 
5 inches soft. All right, you guys, and you can't have barbecue, a barbecue side, without the good old classic mac and cheese. Ooh, just look at that. Oh, <laughs> so cheesy. Mmm, macaroni, elbow, mac and cheese. Mm. Who doesn't love good old fashioned mac and cheese? All right, so we're gonna move on to the sweet, what they call the sweet potato crunch. And mm, <laughs> oh my God, this is probably one of my favorite sides from JD's barbecue. Oh, just look at all that caramelized brown sugar, that sweet potato. Ooh. It does have that crunch. Mm. Sweet, perfectly sweet, and a little bit it has a hint of savoriness to round it off, so it's not just like pure sweetness. Oh my god, I'm just gonna have to go in for another bite of this sweet potato crunch. Mm. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna move on over here to the banana pudding. Mm, also, one of my favorite all time desserts. Just look at all that cream, they have like chunks of banana in here and have some vanilla wafers oof you guys need to get on this right now you guys oof. just look at that <laughs> it's so creamy and you get the crunch from, from, from the vanilla wafers and then you get that nice banana flavor to just and just like coats your mouth. Oh my gosh. You guys, I could probably kill this whole pint right here. <laughs> so when you guys get it, make sure you guys get like a whole bucket of this because I'm telling you, you're gonna go through it. Like nothing. All right, in here, I, I know I'm saying like all the sides are like my absolute favorite, but seriously you guys, the sides are killer at JD's Smokehouse barbecue oh my gosh then this right here is the jalapeno cheese grits Ooh, right there and then you, see, you get like chunks of jalapenos in there what I love about these grits it's an it's not just like like all mushy you still get that nice texture that you get from grits and the jalapeno it's not like super spicy but it has that nice little heat that comes through. These jalapeno cheese grits are a definite favorite. Mm. Ah. All right guys, make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up and click that subscribe button because we're gonna have more Southern food coming your way. But until then, we're gonna try and finish the rest of this food. We'll see you guys in our next video. Peace.